short of the roll call on the main resolution. For nearly five hours on Friday, Declan Dahlberg and others listened to the Board of Regents meeting. That was pretty heartbreaking for everybody in the room, everybody watching online. Only to have their sports taken away from them. Mr. Chair, there are seven in favor and five opposed. By a slim seven to five vote, they dropped men's gymnastics, men's tennis, and men's indoor track and field only sparing men's outdoor track and field on a revised proposal submitted that morning. My teammates aren't here to run on the club. My teammates are here because you know they were state champions, they're national champions, they're top caliber athletes. And for people like that who don't necessarily know the inner workings of you know what we do here, sometimes the first voice in their ear is the voice they follow. And I think Mark Coyle was the first voice in their ear. And you know what what they did with this new proposal was. 100% intentional, you know, and, and it worked for them. As a distance runner for the Gophers, Dahlberg says he feels this is a detrimental loss. And the indoor season is huge for us. I mean, it's Minnesota. It's winter, you know. Um, and, you know, if I, was, if I was three years in the past looking at a school where I want to go, no shot that I, I choose a school that doesn't have an indoor team. The junior participated in the marches and petitions over the last month. But Dahlberg says he hasn't heard from the administration since the decision on Friday. I don't know what our next steps are. I'm sure there will be some. But, you know, we're, we're proud of being Gophers because of that community. And uh, they did a lot for us over these last couple of weeks.